A few months ago, I posted a video about my attempts to add a card reader to my vending machine. The system worked, but the interface was kinda kludgy. You had to first scan your card, then push a button to add a dollar to the machine, and then press your selection. This means you had to know what your selection cost in order to buy it, and if it was sold out, you were screwed. So, I've changed that. Allow me to introduce PopCard 2 Electric Boogaloo. The first thing you'll notice is that it looks much cleaner. No more ugly arcade button with terrible hole cutting. In fact, there are no additional buttons at all. It's even easier to use than before. You simply swipe your card as before. Your name and current balance are displayed. Next, you simply make your selection using the normal selection buttons on the vendor. The pop card system takes it from there. It knows how much each item costs and it adds the correct amount of money into the machine, deducting it from your card. Then it instructs the machine to vend that selection. Mmm, Diet Coke. If the selection is sold out, a message appears when you try to buy it, and no sale is made. To accomplish this feat, I needed to interface with a lot more parts of the machine. The cheapest way to add 27 new inputs and outputs was to switch to an Arduino Mega. A lot easier than using a bunch of shift registers and multiplexers. Okay, so first, the Arduino inserts itself in between the actual buttons on the front and the vendor. When you press a selection button, the Arduino knows, and in normal cases, it closes a relay and passes that signal on to the machine. However, if you have scanned a card, the Arduino takes over the buttons. This is how it knows which selection you want. Once you make a selection, the money is added via the same relay as last time. Then the selection relay is closed, fooling the vending machine into thinking you press that button and it vends the drink. The sold out switches are a bit more complicated. Behind this panel are the vend motors and the machine's own sold out paddles. My sold out sensors are tied into the sold out paddles that the machine itself uses. When a selection is in stock, this paddle is pushed down and the button is released. Hmm, I seem to be sold out of coke. Another bonus of this system is that I can actually see who is buying which drinks and also which drinks are sold out without having to open up the machine. So there you have it, PopCard 2, not quite the same as the first.